Hi guys, in today's video, I'll be teaching you how to add finger colliders to Gorilla Tag fan game. Now, this is a really easy tutorial to do. There's no scripts required, but if you need any help with this, make sure to join my Discord server link in the description. Anyways, guys, make sure to like, subscribe, and let's get straight into the video. So here we are in our game. So just go to Gorilla Rig, Gorilla Player, and then on your left hand controller, right click, 3D object, and then make a capsule. Now this capsule, you're gonna size it down, and you're gonna rotate it, hold down control, and do it six times, so it's 90 degrees. Then just size it down a bit more, and then just make it zero 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 it doesn't matter for now you'll see because now we're going to play the game so go in the game now it doesn't matter if you have an offline rig or not but make sure that your hands are actually rotated correctly so if you have a player model in your game it'll most likely look like this or something what you want to do if you haven't done it already you need to rotate them up like this then rotate them forward like this so then do the same thing with the other hand. This is just in case you haven't done it already. So you're going to do it with your offline rig if you have one. And then also go into resources, photon VR and player. And then you're going to do it to your actual player model too. So just move it up like this and move it like this. This has nothing to do with the actual finger colliders. Well, it kind of does because if they're rotated the wrong way, then they won't be on the actual finger. So make sure it's rotated perfectly the right way, just like that facing forward. Okay, now we can go into the game and play test. Now we need to move the left hand out a bit. Don't make it too far but just make it like this or something and then go to the capsule and then just resize it and move it to however you want it to be so me personally i'm just going to put it there and then put it like there i'm gonna size it up a little bit and then this is good so once you have it where you want it to be where it says transform here click the three dots copy components then go out and make sure you're on the capsule then three dots paste component values then what you're gonna do where it says capsule collider turn on is trigger And if you want, you can just call this left finger collider and then just copy and paste and drag it under right hand and call this one right finger collider and then play test again. And now we're going to do the same movement position thing, but just with the right hand instead of the left hand. So the left hand is already perfect. So we're going to go to the right hand and all that we'll need to do is move it a bit this way and then we're fine. So now transform three dots, copy components and then three dots, paste component values. So now they're in the right place. Now we can just select them both and turn off the mesh renderer so you don't see them make sure tag hand tag layers trigger and then yeah and now if we click play we can move up our gorilla player we can rotate our hand down and as you can see when we click the finger it clicks it but yeah thank you all so much for watching once again join my discord server link in the description if you need any help with this tutorial or any of my other tutorials or if you just maybe part of my awesome community please consider becoming a channel member because it's only two dollars a month and you get so many awesome perks including getting to see my videos early and including getting a shout out at the end of every single video that i make just just like all of the wonderful people on the screen right now. Anyways, guys, make sure to like and subscribe. Thank you all so much for watching. And yeah, guys, that's it for me today. Peace.